Hey folks, hope you're doing good today. Hope you enjoyed that grind call yesterday because man, that was some of the sickest bands I had in the queue. Uh, so yeah, it was a dope one. Now today we've got another dope band on the channel. It's a one-man band, Jacob. We normally know him as Moon Devoured on this channel, but apparently he's got a new project going. He's decided to go with the name Excreta, uh, which is cool name i guess so we're going to check out this one out i don't know what it is uh, he's normally very heavy death gory gurgling vocals uh down tempo stuff like we had on last saturday which was the craziest track we ever had uh, so we'll see what he's going to do with this one this is necropolis of whispers which is a cool name let's give it a spin
fading out on this one. I was expecting a, an abrupt end to this track. Man, the one man band deathcore guys, down tempo deathcore guys that we have on this channel, which we have got a few of now, they all seem to be in a kind of posse online as well, which is dope. Absolutely killing it, in my opinion. Now, I'm not sure who did this mix, whether it was Alex Savigny again. Um, Yes, it was. It's another Alex Savigny track. So there you go. Alex is absolutely killing it for the mixes for these type of guys because he knows exactly what to do to get this kind of sound and, and vibe and just the, the power of the music, the nastiness of the music to come through. Killing it, Alex. Uh, we've seen him doing production for bands over the last 18 months because he's one of the guys that actually got on board with this channel very, very early um with with his band and yeah the, we've seen him do productions for the band so we've seen him get better and better but i'm going to say now his his production is as good as anyone i've heard particularly for this kind of music as well um i haven't got an idea how to do this kind of mix how to get those kind of guitar tones how to get that bass tone even in this mix was absolutely sick had a rattle and a uh, an extra level of nastiness to those guitars and when your guitars are that low and deep and they must be using an eight string guitar as well um you know when you're using an eight string guitar you're basically a semi bass guitar at that point anyway um so the frequencies can really clash when you're using the that lower string uh, guitar and a bass guitar you know it, you're kind of fighting for the same area of the mix at that point these he knows how to get the bass to still cut through have its own tone still provide a bass to that bassy guitar sound as well uh, an extra level of bass is why it sounds so heavy and deep yes killing it a super great track as well these guys must just love going to alex because they know that they're going to get a great sound out of him now so they can just do their thing do their good vocals and all the cool styles that they've got going on in the vocal like the spoken word in this one as well and i did notice on his page that he's got a spoken word band twixt lungs i'll have to check that out because i do like a bit of spoken word in the music i'm not so much into just spoken word but i really like it in metal when you break it down to some atmospheric like they did in this track or in the intro or something like that have some spoken word or have some just recorded um speaking audio from a tv show or anything like that you can really set the atmosphere and vibe to a track immediately I think it did with this track as well where you just knew it was going to be cool as hell uh, from the spoken word and the atmosphere of it all the build up to it and then coming in heavy and nasty yes killing it um so man if i ever make any deathcore music i'm not going to try and mix it myself i'll go straight to alex because uh, i'll know he'll do the perfect job of it so super nice job uh, and really nice as well to get jacob back on the channel doing his thing these guys are killing it with the vocals, some of the highest level vocals that you can do. It might not be your thing if you're not into deathcore, I and mean, you probably haven't got to this far into the video if you're not into deathcore. Um, but, you know, for the people who aren't into deathcore, they should still know that this style of vocal is, is some of the high level vocals that you can do. You know, it's like shredding on a guitar. It's like an amazing drum solo or something like that. These are the guys who practice doing vocals because you can't make the sounds that these guys are making unless you really get control over your throat, practice and practice so that you can keep the, you know, when you hear some of the length of the growls these guys are doing in their tracks, um, if you haven't got complete control over your throat, um, it, you won't be able to hold it for that long you don't have the control to do that it takes practice and that's what people need to know whether they like it or not uh, it is high level vocals i respect it very much i know that, that i know it's high level uh, and anything high level impresses me so i'm impressed by these kind of vocals sick doing a super good job guys keep keep up the good work uh, and i'm looking forward to what, whatever you got coming next because i just know it's going to be heavy nasty down tempo and just kicking ass love it see you around guys bye